Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol CVM. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30-minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. Did this analysis on Wednesday, so that is where the green and red line annotations are coming from. And very nice movement today on this one. I mean, when you stop and think about the price was flirting around down here, now all of a sudden it's worked its way all the way up there. The question now becomes, all right, yeah, it's made a nice move, but is there any sort of true power behind this price movement? Is there any sort of genuine strength? I have no idea, but by using charts and some common sense, we can make answering that very straightforward. So what I'm gonna do here is just first make the initial update, and that update is based on a foundational rule in charting which states when levels of resistance are broken and closed above, you wanna see them act as support. But also what I wanna do is give this a little bit more wiggle room in terms of the price and uh, talk about $9. So how is $9 gonna be helpful? Well, assuming we can agree on the logic that price movements with true power, with genuine strength, the price is gonna progress forward, not go back to where it was then that level can be helpful because like I said, if something is truly strong, you wanna see progress being made in the upwards direction. Whereas if the price were to come down to nine and then just continue on down, what would that be doing to the price? Well, from a very literal perspective, it'd be putting the price right back to where it was when it was flirting with those lows. And again, going back, not exactly a sign of true strength. Whereas on the flip side, if the price were to come down here, behave in this manner and then start to work its way back upwards, now all of a sudden, what would you have? Well, you'd have a set of lows right here you'd have that set of lows down there if you envision each of these as stair steps. Well, hey, at least at that point, you still have progress being made in the upwards direction. And again, that's what a truly move, truly strong move is gonna do. It's gonna make progress forward. So keep a close eye on $9. As far as areas of resistance are concerned, watch that purple line very closely. The 50 period simple moving average currently valued at $14.25. But all in all, nice bounce today, nice movement. Now going into Friday, it's definitely just a question of can the price continue to build upon this momentum? Let's see what happens. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.